is this animal. Can you see it there? You might be able to recognise it by its shape. It's shaped like a star. And you might have heard of a starfish or a sea star, sometimes people like to call them. And this is the most common type of starfish that we find in our rock pools here in Falmouth. It's called a cushion star. Why are they called cushion stars? Well, that's a very good question. I often wonder the same thing myself, and I've seen hundreds of these little things. I think the reason is because usually sea stars have big, long arms sticking right out, and these guys only have dinky little arms, and so they're much more like a little cushion. Although I've never seen a cushion shaped quite like this, but if you ever do see one, let me know, because I think I'd quite like to have that on my sofa. Where will you find cushion stars? Well, you need to go down low down the beach, okay? So when the tide's right out, go out as far as you can like we've done now. The tide's coming in now, so we've got to be a bit careful. We found that cushion star in a rock pool just like this down here, and they're always underneath rocks, okay? They cling onto the underside of rocks. So find a rock, one of the bigger ones, turn it over gently, and oh yeah, that we've got one right here. Let's see if I can get him. There we are. Let's put that back. There we go. Another beautiful little cushion star. I'm going to put this one straight back. What do they eat? Well, let me turn it over and uh, you can see on its underside here, they look quite different. Their mouth is right in the middle there uh, and they have lots of little tube feet. And so they do crawl around quite a lot looking for food and they are what's called opportunistic feeders. So that means that they'll pretty much eat anything they can get hold of. Uh, they'll feed off what's stuff that's called detritus off on the uh, sea floor. So it's anything that really settles on the sea floor that, uh, uh, that can be eaten, they'll gobble it up and uh, transfer it to that little mouth in the middle there.